my wife and I, you know, spent a lot of time saving to put a down payment on a house. But it only took a matter of seconds for scammers to steal all of it from this homeowner and his wife. Close to $100,000. Yeah. Like other victims across the nation, the couple received a realistic looking email from the bank requesting the wire transfer to complete their home purchase. It even included accurate account information. But when they followed up with the bank later, they learned they had been scammed. And he suspects his emails were hacked. Some of that stuff was happening outside of, uh, you know, an encrypted system. So they were able to get into emails and jump into that stuff. It was scary for us. The FBI received more than 2,000 wire fraud complaints per day in 2023, a 10% increase over the year before. Technology is an incredible way to save time. We no longer have to run across town with paper checks. But at the same time, we need to understand what the weaknesses are. Real estate consultant Grant Muller tells Fox 31, he has a firm policy when it comes to down payments sent through wire transfers. Do not send any money unless you've heard from me or had a conversation with me. Muller says clients should be educated about wire fraud as part of the home purchase process. We send out wire fraud disclosures and wire fraud warnings in our emails. So we're trying to cover all of the bases. Great title companies will have secured online portals and they'll use those portals for secure confirmations, secure communications, and that often adds another layer of protection. This homeowner urges other buyers to rely on person-to-person -person communication to verify the payment process. This is people's livelihoods that you're that you're messing with. People spend their whole lives saving saving to be able to afford a house.